Hello and welcome to my Friday. Now this week, I'm going to have my first guest in the office, if you don't count a cardboard Sheena Easton. And my guest is a very, very charming and famous turtle called Butt, who some of you may have seen from some of my previous posts on Facebook and uh, elsewhere. This is a, a dear friend of mine. And here he is. This is Bert. Say hello, Bert. Hello, everyone. It's a great honour to be a green guest here today. So, Bert, we're going to uh, talk to you about all sorts of things and find out a little more about you because the people really want to know. They've been asking. Uh, so, we'll start with, uh, where do you come from? I was born in Covent Garden in a toy shop. But if it sounds more exotic, tell the people I was born in Grand Cayman. It's in the Caribbean. That's where we have turtle farms. And how many brothers and sisters do you have? I have 20 brothers and 842 sisters. Oh, I see. So, who looks after you? As if I don't know. My guardians are called Pad and Rat. They're really so kind to me. Mm. So. Do you think I can tell them that you're called Pad? Tell me what you eat, what do you feed on, and how often do you eat Bert? Well, my favourite meal is milk and Twiglets. I only eat once a week. Well, that's how often I get fed. I also like anything green, especially rocket salad. Yummy. I drink a lot of water, more Twiglets, and sometimes yoghurt. You do like your food, don't you? Although I know you don't eat very often, but is uh, there any danger of you becoming a fat git turtle? I'll take that as a no. For a little wee turtle, you seem to uh, have done quite a lot of travelling. Tell me a bit about where you've been and what you've done. Well, the most amazing place I've been to is New York. I went up the Empire State Building. Pat and Rat took me. I looked through those telescope thingies. It's such an amazing view, but I was scared of being so high above the sea level. I could see the whole city, lots of skyscrapers and even the Statue of Liberty. I recently went to Glastonbury, but I missed the festival by a week. Though I did see the famous Glastonbury Tour. So much green out there in the countryside. Oh, and I've been to France too. I went to the city of Leo where Rat lived and I saw fantastic views of the city from high up on a hill. I think I'd like to go back there and see more. It's good for my shell. They're kind to turtles there, but not so kind to snails and frogs. They eat them. Well, that's amazing for a wee turtle. As a musician, but I have to ask, what kind of music do you like? Well, you might have heard of a 60s band called the Turtles. I like them. Nice catchy tunes. I like Green Onions by Booker T and the MGs. I like a bit of Scritty Politi because the singer's name is Green. And I like that frog Kermit who sang in the Muppets. It's not easy being green. I see. And also I quite like a bit of Rammstein and death metal. And I hear you like a bit of a dance, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> so tell me what you do during the day. What kind of things do you get up to when you're all alone? Well, I really like to wax cars. Can you guess why? It's huge fun. And Rad takes me out on a scooter. It's so exciting. I'm hoping to get my license, but I can't find a crash helmet to fit me. Rad's is far too big for me. I like watching TV or iTurtle Player. A bit of soft shell porn, maybe. Look at this sexy specimen. Oh. I'm quite into fashion, too. What do you think of my new shades? 
I like to talk dirty with my mate Ted. He's not a turtle. He's a tortoise, but he's a nice guy. And I like to go for long walks in the fields. I feel at home where it's very green. I once did a job in Pat's jacket pocket, and I didn't tell him. Well, thank you so much for coming into my office to be interviewed, Bert. The people are going to be very, very pleased to hear a bit more about you. I think you're a real star, and you're very green. Just don't become a fat git turtle. That's rich coming from you. You better keep going to the gym yourself. Say goodbye to everybody out there. See you later outdoors or online turtle lovers. Thanks for listening.